Hi, I'm Tim Keeshan and welcome to my studio. Angel Cove Sunset and I'm very excited to continue on with this series of Angel Cove and I started this about a year ago and um, was kind of stuck on doing these next two paintings simply because of the sense of challenge. What I really wanted to do is take advantage of this scenery and I wanted to be able to use the different opportunities of light throughout the day. And I was happened to be camping at a little cabin for a few days back in September a couple of years ago and uh, was able to have an opportunity to take on this challenge. So finally excited about painting these paintings. Um, for this particular painting here, I kept having a artist in mind and that would be Maxwell Paris. And um, his paintings always had that sense of dawn and sense of fairy tales and a sense of uh, far away and mystical places. And this particular area has those characteristics and I kept thinking to myself, I feel like I'm walking in one of his paintings. It's um, interesting about this lake, it's a very shallow lake. The lake itself, you could probably walk to the middle of the lake and still stand on the ground. So it's kind of an interesting element of a body of water and uh, with it being so shallow, it can become very still. Um, and have a great characteristics of a mirror effect. One element of, about this area here is this rock formation here and of course it gives tribute to my one of my favorite rocks which would be Moro Bay. <laughs> so, so I am uh, very excited about having to be able to continue on with the series which what I mean by that is uh, three or more, so maybe perhaps in the future I'll uh, do another one. But um, without further ado, uh, let's see how this one was made. Mm -hmm. 